Hey guys, welcome to Tips with Dave. This is David here and I'm really excited because today I'm gonna to show you how to make professional channel art for YouTube, okay? Just for YouTube at this moment and then if you need something for Twitter and other channels like, like Instagram, Snapchat, etc., we will get into that. But in this video, I'm gonna talk about YouTube, okay? Really excited, guys. I'm really, really excited. So, as you can see, a year ago, I made some channel art and this picture with the logo the the title tips with Dave is the channel art for YouTube okay so you can find out more if you click on this edit button here you can say edit channel art and if you go I want you guys to do this as well so if you go to how to create channel art YouTube will take you to exactly the support of YouTube which shows you and gives you a lot of interesting information so which you should check out before you actually go and create your image okay now from this um, let's say channel art you can see here the one that I, I made a video a year ago but as you can see it's not really at a professional level the channel art that you see here is more for a channel that maybe has uh, video games on a more growing channel let's say but it's been a year al already and I am enjoying making YouTube videos, okay? So I want, my my content has changed. The content right now on my video is more, on my videos are more educational. Therefore, I, I need to have a channel art which is more uh, suitable for that those kind of viewers, okay? So, what am I gonna do with you in this video today? I am actually going to make channel art all over again okay and I'm gonna show you some examples of what I just did okay so first of all like I said you go to edit and go to this page here okay and I want you to download channel art templates now I have already done that okay so the channel art template is basically this there's a PNG and there's a Photoshop version so if you have Photoshop you can use it with Photoshop and go ahead and make your channel up but this gives you basically the dimensions for desktop tablet and mobile okay so you have this is what we need it's important okay then I want you to create um, an account on Canva okay create an account on Canva it's free and click more okay go to if you go down you go to the section where it shows social media and email headers okay and you have YouTube thumbnail thumbnail YouTube channel art so you click on that it opens a new page what you need to do then is upload what you just downloaded so you go to uploads and you as you can see I've already done it here okay you upload the image Okay, and I have no idea why but in this case I just need to stretch it out to the page so that you have a clear view of everything yep, that should be it okay so you know now that everything has to be within this area so what do you do you can do a lot of things okay so if you take us if you want a special background you can just take a picture with what you have or maybe a screenshot of a background that you like and you can put it on the back end but right now we did this okay now I'll just quickly take an image that I cut earlier but you can put an image you can be as creative with this as you would like okay don't be afraid to be creative with with YouTube it's really awesome okay then you go to text okay now I uploaded the same thing which I did that you upload a picture and then you can add it here okay now if you go to text you can just submit a heading or any other kind of text that you would like okay now the simplest way is to just choose maybe something that is interesting to you so if you like maybe this okay and you can the thing is with this you can see when it, when I put it on the page it's really small so I wouldn't choose something that is too small 
then again maybe something like this okay so you have and make sure it fits within the area that you have for the page okay so what you can do is really cool you can actually click on this text so you don't have to really create anything you can choose whatever you like whatever kind of font you like okay so for example if this is the case and you write tips with Dave okay oh that didn't edit so let's try again okay whatever you would like so I could change this as well and I could type video marketing just to give you guys a fast a fast um, tutorial on it okay then obviously you can edit this all by maybe making it bold italic depending on what you actually would like okay I'm just gonna leave it like this for now okay and what you can also do is you can upload any kind of background now what you do is basically when you upload a background I'm gonna show you with one of these backgrounds which are already there but you can just really upload in a picture yourself you can see now that this will be your YouTube banner what happens is you can add a border to this you can add another picture for example here now I want to actually take out this so that you know it's in white and you can see my name properly so really simple as you can see it looks much better now if I go to download okay JPEG it just takes a second and it downloads very fast it doesn't change your it, it has a good graphic size so everything looks nice okay and I'll just open it guys you see I'm not a Windows user or a Mac user I actually use Linux so you can see I just made a quick banner saying you know and you can put for example Facebook Twitter whatever logos you want here as well okay really fast really easy you can be as creative as you want as you can see I haven't done this very well of cutting the image out but you know you can do whatever you want with a, just a simple text banner you can take out the image and just keep tips with the video marketing you know and it looks professional it looks quite professional okay what you do then is just go to YouTube okay click here edit channel art upload the picture now I wanted to show you guys that I was just kind of creating my own channel art yesterday and I really liked one I don't know whether if it was this yeah this was one of the videos that but I didn't like it so much one of the channel art that I did this is another option for example as you can see I put my whole uh, I put subscribe now just to have you know an advantage of, of having this thing now for example if I want to upload this you see it's blackbird 3 okay so let's go to here and we go to channel art templates because that's where I put it and we go this yeah let's upload this or we can upload the subscribe one okay so just upload okay and it shows you exactly how it will look on desktop TV or mobile okay mobile you don't need to put auto enhance because then you know you could just you can adjust crop depending on how it, I don't know depending on what you would like etc 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 okay then once you're done you click select and voila okay now what happens is here I what I did was I pushed everything if you noticed when I was doing the the editing yesterday I pushed everything to one side okay so I use like for example the whole desktop version I would suggest that you use okay when you're going let me just wait a minute let's just uh, show you this one let's try this 
okay you can see on the desktop it the way it is okay and on mobile how it is now uh, adjust and crop you can see that if someone is on they will basically see one picture of myself and just that you know which is not really not really that cool okay so what is my tips for this when you're creating a YouTube channel you remember that I told you about this upload okay this is the key now you can see very clearly that they have said logo safe area so try to do the video okay so try to put all your graphics within this dark area here if it's within the dark area here it shouldn't be a problem okay so now if wait just a minute because it's too big I want to show you exactly so I'm what I did was yesterday I created some graphics which were m a mistake just to show you guys exactly what can happen okay so you follow can you see this dark area you follow that okay and make sure that you're within this dark area okay now I can for example remove the back and you just have white and let's download this uh, doesn't really matter. Just save it. Okay. Takes a second to save. Okay. Great. Save file. And let's get back. Say upload picture. We don't want that picture, okay? So we just uploaded, downloaded something. So it should be this one. Yep. So you will be able to see the actual value of the mistake that I did. And voila! That is the difference. Can you see? If you have everything in the dark area, you are sure to be visible on screen as simple as that guys it's very easy to make your channel art and you can go as creative as you would like with Canva and I, I tell you you can create a logo if you want for free thumbnails everything possible and I'm gonna go in detail with this tool but you can just create I'm gonna leave a link below okay I'm gonna leave a link below for the site Canva so you can sign up okay there's no affiliate or anything just a link for you guys to know that it is available okay and if you did like this video just hit the thumbs up let me know what you think if it was helpful or no or no and I'm tips with Dave guys and I make basically weekly videos to teach you guys on graphics on editing on different kinds of actual um, practices that you should have while you're doing your online marketing and give you also a bit of traffic sources okay if you do like the content that you're receiving on this channel, hit the subscribe button and let me know what you think. Have a great day, guys.